I mean, this is the key distinction that I think people don't realize is, you know, that oftentimes when you talk about autonomous vehicles, you're, there's often a driver in the seat that's ready to, um, to take over uh, what, what's called a safety driver. And then Waymo is really one of the only companies, at least that I'm aware of, or at least as like boldly and carefully and all and all of that is actually has cases. And now we'll talk about more and more where there's literally no driver. So that, that's another, the, in the interesting case of where the driver is not supposed to disengage, that's like a nice middle ground. They're still there, but they're not supposed to disengage. But really there's the case when there's no, okay. There's something magical about there being nobody in the driver's seat. Like, just like to me, you mentioned um, the first time you wrote some uh, code for free space navigation of the parking lot, that was like a magical moment. To me, just sort of an, as an observer of robots, the first magical moment is seeing an autonomous vehicle turn, like make a left turn, like apply sufficient torque to the steering wheel to where it, like there's a lot of rotation. And for some reason, and there's nobody in the driver's seat, for some reason that that communicates that here's a being with power that makes a decision. There's something about like the steering wheel, because we, we perhaps romanticize the notion of the steering wheel. It's so essential to the, our conception, our 20th century conception of a car. And it turning the steering wheel with nobody in the driver's seat, that to me, I think maybe to others, it's really powerful. Like this thing is in control. And then there's this leap of trust that you give. Like I'm gonna put my life in the hands of this thing that's in control. So in that sense, when there's no but no driver in the driver's seat, that's a magical moment for robots. So I I'm uh, I got a chance to uh, last year to take a ride in a, in a Waymo vehicle, and that that was the magical moment. There's like nobody in the driver's seat. It's it's like the little details. You would think it doesn't matter whether there's a driver or not, but like if if there's no driver and the steering wheel is turning on its own. I don't know. That's magical. It's, it's absolutely magical. Like I, I've taken many of these rides in a completely empty car. Yeah. No human in the car pulls up. Yeah. You know, you call it on your cell phone, it pulls up. It's you great. get in, it takes you on its way. There's yeah. nobody uh, in the car but you, right? That's something called you know fully driverless you know, or uh, rider only uh, mode of operation. Uh, yeah, it, it it is magical. It is you know. Uh, transformative. This is what we hear from our uh, writers. It kind of really changes your experience. And that, like that, that really is what unlocks the real potential of this technology.